God sent this preacher to open your eyes. Open your eyes. Turn you from darkness to light. That's right. From the power of Satan unto God. That's it. It's a beautiful thing when a blind man's eyes come open. Oh, yeah. When a blind woman's eyes come open. That's right. Jesus said, blessed are That's your it. eyes. For they see. For now, they see. They see. When your understanding come open, mm -hmm. the opening of an understanding brings about mixed emotion. Yeah. It brings joy and anger. That's true. You're joyful because now you understand. Mm -hmm. You angry because you looked at the time you waste and the years you were being robbed. That's right. And the amount of lies you was being told. Amen. Here you were sincere mm -hmm. and loyal. Mm -hmm. You think some of the things I preach, these men don't know? A lot of them lot know of, it. But of because them. it won't make them money. Right. Because they can't get rich because right. they can't get a mansion or a car as a result of it. They say, I won't preach it. Won't preach it. That's right. So they'd rather give you a bunch of trash. That's right. Look at the neighbor and say, neighbor, you own the good food. <laughs> My Lord. My Lord. They'd rather tell you, get up. And when I count to three, mm. stomp on the floor. Right. We're going to stomp on the devil's head. The devil don't feel that. No, no. No. Gimmicks, Gimmicks. schemes. Mm -hmm. Why, if any of us is from the hood along with myself, mm -hmm. we all know what a hustle is. That's right. You cannot deny the fact church is the biggest hustle, biggest hustle. in the world. Amen. Go ahead, man. Are right, you listening to the old man? Go ahead. Listen. And after the wind and earthquake. After the wind, now the devil come along and brought an earthquake. But the Lord was not in the earthquake. But the Lord didn't do it. That's right. What else? And after the earthquake. After the earthquake. A fire. Look at the devil was busy. Amen. A fire. But the Lord was a not. A form mm -hmm. of anointing. A form. That's right. Fire came. That's right. But what was the result? But the Lord was not in the fire. Brothers and sisters, mm. the activity that is going on. Yeah. Can you differentiate? Can you distinguish mm -hmm. whether God is in it, in it or is it the moving of the devil? That's it. The preacher that is in a pulpit with a written out text. That's right. And then he loses pages and then just blood out of tongue. Uh, <laughs> That's right. How can these men like Robert Tilton mm. get on the television for one and two and three hours mm -hmm. and beg you for money. Beg you for money. And then tell you, wait a minute, wait a minute, here it come, here it come. There, there it is. There it is. There it is. If, if, if you didn't understand, the Lord just said 50,000, 50,000. That's right. 50, there it is again. There it is 50, again. 50,000. You That's sucker. It. Amen. Go ahead, brother. You're being duped. Oh, yes. It shows you how men don't fear God. That's right. That they will use God to rob the world. That's right. Steal my words. And we, as money lovers, yeah. we want the money so bad. I've seen preachers hmm. tell the viewing audience, get a piece of paper, trace your hand. Yes, they will. Cut it out and send it to me. That's right. He said, when I get it, I'm going to put my hand yeah. on your hand. Yeah. And we're going to touch, touch and agree. And agree. <laughs> That's right. My Lord. And we fall for this gimmick. Yeah. The center of church mm -hmm. is supposed to be God. The nucleus of the spiritual universe right. yeah. is God. That's right. When God is absent from church, hmm. that church is not a church. It's not a church. When you take God out of religion, mm -hmm. then that religion is founded upon men's ideology. That's right. We contradict strongly men's Ideas. That's right. Because the Lord says, My thoughts is not yours. Not yours. 
Listen. And after the earthquake, a fire. A fire. But the Lord was not in the fire. The Lord wasn't in that. And after the fire, a still small voice. Uh -oh. God came to the prophet in a way that people wouldn't expect. That's right. Have you noticed all the other activity represent moving of power? Right. So God come in an unpredictable manner. That's right. All this power, hmm. but he come softly. Softly. Tenderly. That's right. Because when you say God, you're looking at the shaking of the earth, the moving of the universe, and all this. And God know the way the colonel minds think. Oh, yeah. So a devil come like that to imitate God, and God come smoothly. That's right. Calmly. Calmly. A small, still, still small voice. A small, yet patient, oh, yeah. yet strong, oh, yeah. yet stern, mm -hmm. piercing mm -hmm. voice. That's right. Uh -huh. And it was so when and he, it was so when Elijah heard when it, the prophet heard it that he wrapped his face now in his he mantle. Got busy. That's right. Ladies and gentlemen, brothers and sisters, in the church, in the mosque, mm -hmm. in the synagogue, mm -hmm. you're supposed to hear God. Hear God. How do we hear God? If the message contradicts this book, yeah. you ain't hearing God. No, no. It doesn't matter if the man hype you up and you break dance. That's right. All this religious trash, Christian rappers. Mm. Isn't it somehow these rappers would make videos cussing? <laughs> Half naked girls? Yeah. Talking about how they want to murder and rob? And then get an award and say, Jesus made it possible. Jesus made it possible. I want to thank Jesus today. What kind of bundle of trash is that? That's right. Go ahead, brother. They want to incorporate Jesus. Yeah. And everything. In every. So the man that done divorced his wife <laughs> and got another, mm -hmm. he'll say the Lord did that. The Lord did that. But then when that don't work out and you get a third one, mm -hmm. he said the Lord did that. Well, did the Lord make a mistake twice? My Lord. My Lord. Do you see the lies? Mm -hmm. Man and woman live together, not married. They say the Lord put us together. Yeah. And we didn't have to get married because when we had sex, that Seal the marriage. That's it. No, that seal you're fornicated. That's it. That's all that was. That's Do it. you see how they try to manipulate the scripture mm -hmm. to make sin acceptable? Right. They want to downplay sin and alleviate the strength of it mm -hmm. to make it fair seeming. That's right. There is a way. There is a way which seemeth right unto a man. You that are here, you that are watching, question mm -hmm. the way you're in. Question it. Look right. at it. Right. Look at the women that is in the pulpits of your church. That's right. And ask yourself, why are they up there? Why are they there? Why are they up there? They up Who put them up there? Amen. Do you find a woman preacher in here? No. Someone said Mary preached the first message. You was a liar. This didn't say it. No. It never said Mary preached to nobody. No, it didn't. She was Jesus' mama, but she was not Jesus' preacher. That's right. That's right. So where did this come from? Where did, mm -hmm. Deaconess, women deacons. Who told you? Who told you? Sister? Mm. From the book that you can be a deacon. I don't care what your pastor said. That's right. Where did God tell you? Where did God say? A homosexual church. Preach a right. homosexual synagogue. Amen. A homosexual mosque. Who gave you the right? Yeah. The set up a dirty mosque. That's right. What kind of synagogue is it? Give me the book of Revelation. Book of Revelation. 
Amen. Give me the book of Revelation. Amen. Go ahead, brother. The Apostle John will tell us what kind mm -hmm. of synagogue this is. Mm -hmm. See, synagogue represents house of God. That's right. But you got a house of God and you got the house of Baal. You got the church of God and you got the church of the devil. That's right. The apostle John teaches us mm -hmm. about the synagogues of Satan. Satan. That's right. Synagogue of Satan. Mm -hmm. House of the devil. In Revelation chapter 2 and verse 9. Listen. I know thy works. Give chapter and verse again. Revelation chapter 2 and verse 9. What did God say? I know thy works. All right, viewers, and you that are here, God know what's going on in every religious place. That's right. You can't duck and hide. I don't care who you are. That's God right. knows. That's right. God said, I know what you're doing. I know thy works. I know what you're doing. And tribulation. And I know what you're dealing with. And poverty. And poverty. But thou art rich. But you're rich. And I know Hold the... Hold it. Mm -hmm. That's not a prosperity plan. <laughs> That's right. That's right. I know your poverty. Poverty. But thou art rich. But you're rich. What do you mean? I know your spiritual state of being. Right. Spiritually. That's right. I know your condition. That's it. You may be poor, mm -hmm. but there's a rich teaching among you. That's it. To elevate you. That's right. Don't you hear the book says about Jesus for our sake? Mm -hmm. He became poor. Became poor. That we through his poverty right. might be rich. That's right. That's right. I'm a rich man. Go ahead, brother. Not in houses. No. Not in land. Mm -hmm. Not in a bankroll. Right. I'm not rich that way. That's right. But I have the knowledge of the ancient one. That's right. Now, mm -hmm. what do you think would outlast? Mm -hmm. Your money or wisdom? Wisdom. Wisdom excel folly. folly. That's right. As light do of darkness. That's right. Listen. I know thy works and tribulation. I know thy works and tribulation. And poverty. Poverty. But thou art rich. Yet you're rich. And I know the blasphemy. I know the blasphemy. Of them which say they are Jews. Of them that say they are God's people. And are not. And they are not. But are the synagogue of Satan. Amen. Let's go to work. Go to work. Blasphemy of them that say they, they are Jews. Are Jews. Mm -hmm. It's beyond an outward Jew. Beyond that. Blasphemy of them that say they are Jews, Jews, meaning those that profess to be the people of God. That's right. But they are the synagogue of Satan. Of Satan. A homosexual cannot be a Christian. No, cannot be. Not being a homosexual yeah. at the same time. No way. No way. You can't stroke men. Go ahead, brother. You can't marry men. Go ahead. And say you of God. That's right. Can't be done. No. You can't say, Bill can't say God gave him Bob. <laughs> no way. Can't say that. Am I right, I say? That's right. Bill cannot say that God gave me Bob. No. And me, uh, me and Bob are lovers. No way. No, no. Sally cannot say that God gave her Ruth. Mm -hmm. Naomi couldn't say God gave her Ruth and they got married. <laughs> no way. No. No. No, no. When two men and two women get married mm -hmm. and say they're Christian, mm -hmm. for once, let me enlighten you. Go ahead, brother. And I want everyone watching and listening Go ahead. around the world. Mm -hmm. Every man mm -hmm. that married a man Every woman that say you married a woman, right. you are not 
married. No way. No, no. You're not married. You're not married. You're not married. No, no. No. God established marriage, mm -hmm. not Barack. That's right. That's right. God set it up. That's right. Now, some of you parents that are watching, you would take great offense at this preaching because you have homosexuals in your house. Mm -hmm. Some of you, your daughters are like this, your sons are like this, your daddy is like this, your uncle is like this, your mm -hmm. grandmama's like this, your aunt is like this, your niece is like this, your nephew is like this, your slap happy grandpappy is like this. That's right. And your pastor's like this. And the pastor. Praise the Lord. <laughs> Go ahead. So you take great offense. Go ahead. Well, you talking about my son. I most certainly am. That's right. You talking about my mama. I sure am. Oh, yes. When it come to God, who are you? Who are you? Either you're straight or you're crooked. That's right. That's right. Go ahead. Man. John the Apostle mm -hmm. said what? Which say they are Jews. They say they are the children of God. And are not, but are the synagogue of Satan. A Christian man with a woman dress on, wearing makeup, wearing makeup. parading down the street. Amen. Abomination. What kind of ignorance is this? My Lord. And people get offended because we speak so strong against it. Mm -hmm. I'm not a gay basher. Mm -hmm. I'm a sin killer. That's it. That's it. That's what I am. That's it. Every real man of God that walked earth. That's right. Is a sin killer. A killer. Amen. He attacked the deeds. That's it. Of the unrighteous. That's right. That's right. Doesn't matter if it's in your household. No, no. Your household, my household, nobody's nobody. household is exempted. That's right. That's right. Are oh, you listening to the old troublemaker? Which say they are Jews. They say they are Jews. And are not. They're not. But are the synagogue of Satan. So you got synagogues, you got one of the largest synagogues in Pennsylvania, mm -hmm. a gay synagogue. Mm. You got mosque. The opening prayer of the Quran is called the Al Fataha. There is a gay organization that took on the name of the opening prayer, the title of it, and called them the Al Fataha Homosexual Muslims. My Lord, my Lord. Hmm. Baptist Homosexual Churches. My Lord. Apostolic hmm. Homosexual Churches. Oh, yes. Pentecostal. Hmm. Homosexual churches. Amen. Look at the gospel singing industry. Look at it. Look at you it. may not like what I'm saying, but you watch BET. Go ahead. Look at it. Go ahead. Men lip shining, shining like they got armor all on it. That's right. Am I right? That's right. Men leading choirs. Go ahead. More feminine than the women on the choir. Go ahead, brother. Go ahead. And you patronize it. How can you buy tickets My Lord. to a gospel show mm -hmm. to look at gospel singing dykes? Amen. Gospel singing homosexuals. Go ahead. And you say you're Christians? My Lord. I you are a liar. That's right. That's right. Go ahead, man. I had someone write me and ask me a question about Tyler Perry's mm. comedy skits. Mm. Go ahead, brother. Give me the book of Deuteronomy. In Deuteronomy chapter 22 and at verse 5. Amen. Go ahead, man. See, me personally, I don't care who you are. No. You can sue me. I ain't got nothing to give you. That's right. That's right. 
Go ahead, man. God, God. and entertainment don't mix. That's right. Let me say it again. God and entertainment don't mix. That's right. If you knew the Bible, you would not buy a ticket to see such garbage. That's right. But again, we are ignorant church-going Bible-carrying suckers. Oh, yes. Let's see what God says mm -hmm. about this madness. In Deuteronomy chapter 22 and at verse 5. Listen. The woman shall not wear that which pertaineth unto a man. You got women getting dressed up like men. Yeah. Want to wear pants like a man? Yeah. If you don't know no better woman, I don't blame you. Mm -hmm. It's only because you don't have no teaching. That's right. But you want to wear low ride jeans mm -hmm. showing where your back side begins yeah and a thong hanging out of that Amen. with a tattoo over the separation of your backside <laughs> go ahead with no shame no shame you want to wear a skirt or a dress shorter than my jacket oh yeah with no shame that's right you want to put a tattoo on your breast mm -hmm. And then wear something low to show your cleavage. Yeah. Then when a the man look at your breasts and sisters, you want to get angry, then, then cover up your turkey. That's right. You're going to show it, show and it. then want to get upset when a man look at it. That's right. What you showing so much of it for? Amen. And you men who want to get upset with other men because they looking at your woman. Yeah. Don't get upset with him. You get upset with her. You let her come out half naked. Go ahead. Go ahead, man. Go ahead. The book says, The woman shall not wear that which pertaineth unto a man. What else? Neither shall a man put on a woman's garment. God said for a man, don't put on woman's clothes. How do God feel about a man putting on women's clothes? For all that do so. No, they're a movie star. All that do so. Democrat. All that do so. Republican. All that do so. Sinner. All that do so. Entertainer. All that do so. Musician. All that do so. They're putting on a play. All that do so. All that do it. Are abomination unto the Lord thy God. Tyler Perry is committing abomination. abomination. That's right. All that do so. Go ahead. Go ahead. A grown man. Mm. Preach it, brother. Put on a wig to look like a woman. That's right. Fake breasts to look like a woman. That's right. Fake hips to look like a woman. Amen. All that do so. Make mockery. Mm. And if you look at all his plays and movies, they always sent around somebody getting a new man and remarrying while the first wife or Still first living. husband is living. In other words, condoning divorce and justifying adultery. That's right. That's right. Amen. Why he run around like a woman, committing every time he step his feet in those stockings. My Lord. He's pulling up. Go, abomination. Abomination. That's right. Every time he put on that fake woman suit. Go ahead. He's putting on. Abomination. Abomination. Yeah. Every time his makeup artist paint his lips. Yeah. Abomination, abomination on his mouth. Right. Fake eyelashes. That's right. Abomination. That's right. Powder puff. Amen. Abomination. Yes. Slap the wig on. Mm. Abomination. Abomination. God said, All everybody that do, so. that do it. All that do so. Talk to me. Are abomination. All that do so. All that do so. God said it. All that do so. When mm. movie stars, mm. men, yes. get dressed like women. Go ahead. It's an abomination. an abomination. You become rich mm. by blasphemy. That's right. And when you pay tickets to see it and you know what's going awesome. on, 
you are contributing to blasphemy. That's right. When you buy a DVD and you know it's on there, you contribute to blasphemy. Go ahead. Go ahead, brother. Go ahead. Not he that doeth the wrong. Go ahead. But he that have pleasure. Them that do it. And them that do it. What's funny about a grown man dressed like a woman? Amen. Abomination. Since when did abomination, abomination become a joke? That's right. You can be damned for such. Go ahead. Go ahead. But because the Bible now has become a book of jokes. That's true. The devil know how to turn the minds of people. That's right. Make the Bible a book of jokes. That's right. So now stand-up comedians mm -hmm. crack jokes, crack jokes about, about the Bible. That's right. Everybody falling out laughing. Laughing. But the great judge is coming. Yes. Who's gonna laugh? Go ahead. When the judge come. Go ahead. Go ahead, brother. Won't be funny then. Won't be funny. When one foot is on the clouds. Yes. And the other is on the sea. That's right. And he tell the wind, stand still. Yes. The day of the Lord. Go ahead. Will come. It's, it's coming. It's All coming. the fun mm. is going out of the earth. Yes, it will. Yes, it will. Amen. Are you listening to the old troublemaker? Neither shall a man put on a woman's garment. This is God talking. That's right. Not Geno Jennings. No. Why would you want your son see a man dressed like a woman? Go ahead. Why would you want your baby see a man dressed like a woman? Go ahead. That's planting a subliminal message in their mind. That's right. Go ahead, brother. Next thing you know, you got your little son. Putting on your shoes yeah. and your wig. Yeah. Look, mommy, Look I'm, mommy, I'm Tyler Perry. That's right. Dang cute. Go ahead. He can go up and become a cross dresser. That's right. That's right. Go ahead, man. Didn't I tell you God's way? Go ahead. It's not like ours. It's not like ours. Go ahead. What's funny to us <laughs> yes. is a cuss to God's eyes. Amen. What's a joke to us? Yes. It's abomination, abomination to God. That's right. When a man in Hollywood mm. get dressed like a woman, mm. it's an abomination. Abomination. Your children don't get in school plays. Right. Where the boy get dressed like a girl. That's right. Or the girl get dressed like a boy. Amen. Or put on, or the girl put on boys' apparel, or the boy put on girls' apparel. No! That's right. If you don't dress your children like that at home, don't you dare let some cheap school district dress them up like that to entertain them. Go ahead. This is old fashioned preaching. Oh, yeah. There is a way. Is a way. Which seemeth right unto a man. And you know what people will say? Pastor Jennings is too radical. And fools make a mock at sin. Do you hear this? In Proverbs 14 and verse 9. Proverbs 14 and 9 says, Fools what? make a mock. Who do it? Fools. Who? Fools. Who? Fools. But they're millionaires. Fools. They got Emmys. Fools. Grammys. Fools. Made five million that year. Fools. Got a Bentley. Fools. Maybach. Fools. Rolls. Fools. Ferrari. Fools. Porsche. Fools. Got a mansion. Fools. Yacht. Fools. On Time Magazine. Fools. In Forbes. Fools. That's right. Go ahead, brother. Got a Swiss bank account. Fools. Bank account in the Cayman Islands. Fools. In the Bahamas. Fools. They white. Fools. Black. Fools. Brown. Fools. Yellow. Fools. Short. Fools. Fat. Fools. Tall. Fools. That's right. Amen. Amen. Oh, yeah. Mm. Regardless that this is in the Bible, mm. you know what the arrogance say? Mm -hmm. I don't 
don't see nothing wrong with it. That's, that's just his interpretation. <laughs> that's right. That's what they'll say. How much plainer is it written? Amen. Read Deuteronomy again. Back in Deuteronomy 22 and 5. How the much plainer is it written? The woman shall it's not. It's just as plain as when our parents told us, if I got to talk to you again, I'm going to beat your behind. That's right. We didn't go to our mother and father and say, please explain that to us. <laughs> That's right. Will you please let us, what is that revelation? What does that mean? That's right. We understood it right away. Right away. So when people hear scriptures that hit them right to the heart, right then we become a volunteer nut. That's right. Right then we just, oh, I, I, I don't understand that. Don't understand that that really didn't mean that. So you got to read between the lines. <laughs> That's right. Do you hear it? In Deuteronomy 22 and 5, the woman shall not wear that which pertaineth unto a man. What is that you don't get? Mm -hmm. You don't go putting on your husband's clothes. That's it. That's it. What is it you don't get about that? That's right. What else? Neither shall a man put on a woman's garment. What man don't understand that? Raise your hand. Mm. What man in here don't know what it means not to put on the clothes of a, woman. of a woman? What man don't understand it? Raise your hand and show your ignorance and embarrass yourself. <laughs> That's right. Come on. Go because ahead. I want the camera to zoom in on you. <laughs> huh? Amen. Can you imagine Pastor Jennings come up one day in a meeting in a large crowd like this, uh -huh. and I come from the side door on with my wife's pumps uh -huh. and her hat and, and, and her skirt or dress and got her pocketbook coming up. <laughs> my Lord. Dan may be up speaking French, a new song, Nova Creed. <laughs> The moment he see me, I knew I'm not sure. <laughs> oh, yes. That's right. Could you blame him? No. Now, if I came in like that, some of you is so ignorant, you still will follow me. That's right. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> some of you is just that dumb, you still will follow me. That's right. Still follow me. I wouldn't follow myself. Because <laughs> right then, that means get away from that man. Right then. That's right. Right then. I say that to show you how ignorant the human family has become. God has spoken. Neither shall a man put on a woman's garment. You don't ignore God for entertainment. That's right. Go ahead, man. The Lord says, I'm coming as a thief in the night. Yes. What thief calls you when he comes? Right. He just come. That's, that's right. You may be sitting up at one of them plays, falling out laughing. Falling out. All of a sudden, all this commotion is in the streets. Mm. And you come out and look up, there's God. Yes. And all these trillions of bodies is defying gravitational pull. Yeah. Coming up out of the graves. Mm. Some graves that buildings are built upon. That's right. But you was at the wrong place at the mm. wrong time, watching the wrong thing, yeah. having fun, having indulging fun. in the wrong event. The Lord said, That's right. be ye also ready. Also ready. For me to be ready, I got to take my soul sincerely. That's right. That's right, baby. Go ahead. I got to be sincere enough that if my wife don't want to be saved, mm. I'm going. Yeah. If my husband don't want to be saved, I'm going. That's right. If my children reject me, I'm going. That's right. Go ahead, brother. Go ahead. When yeah. that woman tell you, look, you can believe that crazy man if you want. <laughs> and he tell her, look, baby, everything you told you was in the Bible. Mm. And then she say the ultimate thing. I don't care if it is. Yes. You ain't getting no more of this stuff. Mm. If you go there, then you and your stuff are stuff in hell. Yes. Woman, your womb don't put enough heat on a man, 
equal to hell. No, no. No way. No he told way. Abraham, get out from among your kindred. Yeah. Go ahead. You love hmm. from the heart, but you don't love no man or no woman with all, all your, your heart. heart. That's right. The only one you love with all your heart is God. That's right. Huh? Go ahead. Go ahead, man. You love from the heart. That's it. But the only one that you give all your heart to is the Lord. That's right. Why is it like that? That's right. Because the man may backslide. Yeah. But if he got all your heart, yeah. you're going to run out there with him. with him. That's right. The woman may backslide. Mm -hmm. And if she got all your heart, you're going to run out there with her. Your children may turn on God. Yes. But if they got all your heart, they're going to pull you out the church. But if God have all your heart, all your heart. let the winds blow. Go ahead. Let the rocks rain. Go ahead. Let the foundations of the deep be broken. Go ahead, brother. God Go ahead. is faithful. Yes. I'm staying with God, Jack. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Go ahead, man. Anybody that have in mind to stay with God, stay with God. you got to pay a price. Oh, yeah. It ain't easy. No, it's not. He never said it would be. No. Hmm. Anybody got in mind to walk with God, you got to give up something. Mm -hmm. And you may have to give up somebody. Yes. To walk with God, you got to give up that second wife. That's right. You know her husband's still living. That's right. Because you and her husband grew up together. Mm -hmm. <laughs> huh? Go ahead. Thank God, and he divorced her. Mm -hmm. And now you got her. Yeah. Mm -hmm. mm. You got to give her up. Got to give her up. Or you ain't getting into the kingdom of God. That's right. Well, Pastor Jennings, I've never been married before, but she is married. That means you living in fornication and she's living in adultery because she got the living companion. That's right. In other words, you got another man's tire. Yeah, another man's. That's your rolling on. Mm. Rolling, rolling, rolling. <laughs> Go ahead, man. Slow your roll. <laughs> That's right. Anyone that got in mind to be right, yeah. you got to surrender. Oh, yes. You got to come out the Masonic Hall. Come out, come out. Come out. Prestige ain't worth trash. No. Be a Mason, you got to roll up one pants leg, mm -hmm. tear the shirt over your heart. Mm -hmm. And they bring you in a room with a bunch of fools. Yeah. They tell you you got to bring food to feed a goat, and there ain't no goat to feed. Yeah. Blind for you. Then a bunch of men making a bunch of noise and hitting you. Mm -hmm. First they put marbles out. Mm. White marbles and a black marble. Mm -hmm. Get a black marble, you're blackballed. Right. Can't be one. <laughs> Get a white marbles, you can be one. <laughs> You get at a certain level of masonry, you get rid of the Bible My Lord. and pick up the Quran. My Lord. You got to take a vow of secrecy, mm -hmm. but you never expose the craft. Mm. If you expose the craft, you agree to have your tongue cut out or snatched out and your heart cut out. My Lord. I expose all the craft I want. The craft, I man. dare you to lay a hand on me. That's right. I dare you to do it, and I want you to do it. That's right. I'm a very easy man to find. Amen. You see, I'm a real Mason. Go ahead, brother. Go ahead. It ain't got nothing to do with Herman. No. It ain't got nothing to do with some cheap lion's paw. No, no. 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 I'm a real Mason. That's right. This That's is too right. deep for the Masonic Hall. It's too deep for them. Every true man of God is a real Mason. That's right. He's a craftsman. He's a craftsman. 
He's a layer of divine brick. That's right. Go he ahead. worked for a master builder. Go ahead. For the book says one mm -hmm. is your master. One is your master. Even Christ. That's right. Peter called the church and said, you as lively stones. That's right. Build so the up. preacher are given tools. Yes. He given a hammer mm -hmm. that breaks rocks and pieces. Oh, yeah. His wisdom is a divine chisel. Go ahead. That cut and carves women and shape men. Go ahead. To be the people of God. That's it. Go ahead. He used a plumb line, plumb line. Go ahead. in the midst of his building. Go ahead, brother. God mm -hmm. is his architect. That's right. This is bigger than Solomon's temple. Oh, yes. Solomon's temple fell apart. That's right. God's temple is eternal. That's right. In the heavens. Go ahead, brother. I'm a divine mason. Oh, yes. I'm a divine builder. Mm -hmm. I was given an ax. And God says, lay it at the roots. Lay it at the roots. I was given a hammer. Yeah. Break rocks in pieces, meaning it breaks the stubborn of the world. That's right. Breaks your stubborn mind. That's it. You see, you got to fall on this stone. Yes. Which would mean submit the hardness. That's it. Submit the discipline. Mm -hmm. Submit the rough preaching. Rough preaching. Then you'll be broken. That's right. But if you fall on the stone, mm -hmm. or the stone fall, fall on, on you, you, you to it's going to grind you to powder. That's right. Go ahead, brother. So Masons don't know what the Masonic is. No, 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 no. You talk about a scale, mm -hmm. a compass? compass. Do you know what direction God come from? Go ahead, brother. Go ahead. God said, I Go come from Teman. Teman. How can he come from somewhere when he is everywhere? That's right. Go ahead, brother. He said, God come from Teman. Go ahead. The Holy One from Mount Paran. From Mount Paran. Yeah. From his mouth. Come of a two-edged sword. That's right. And his eyes Go ahead. is as a flame of fire. fire. From his hands Go ahead. goeth forth horns. Go ahead. And when he walk upon the waters. Go ahead. You think a mason is wearing white gloves? White gloves. And a little miniaturized apron? That's right. You don't know what it is. No, no. A mason is a divine man of God. That's it. Who's given tools from heaven. That's right. That cut and shape the hearts of the world. That's right. And build a people Go ahead. for God. Amen. Go ahead. Hallelujah. Go ahead. Go ahead, brother. A lion's paw? Nah. Oh, no. It's the lion Go ahead. of the tribe Judah. of Judah. Oh, yes. And the root of David. That's it. That's it. Go you build it on Solomon? Mm. That's weak. That's weak. One that is written. The scripture says mm. one greater and than Solomon, Solomon is, here. is here. That's right. Solomon ain't no good. Oh, no. One greater than Solomon. It's here. Masonry. Mm. I'm a divine mason. Every house is built by some man. Do you hear this? In Hebrews chapter 3 and at verse 4. Oh, this is so sweet. Every house. Every house. Is built by some man. Is built by some man. But he that built all things. He that built everything. Is God. No, it's Solomon. Is God. Herman Mabliff. Is God. Amen. Mm. Our God is God. That's right. That's right. So Solomon was limited. Oh, yeah. Not only that, he ran out of his wits. Yes, he did. For women. For women. Hmm. Solomon, before he died, his heart turned against God. Turned against God. And he became polytheistic. Yes, he did. An idolater. That's right. The true architect, mm -hmm. the true designer of people hmm. is God. It's God. That's right. So all these lodges and all that stuff won't prevail. No. You throw on black suits, white shirt, and black tie and feel important. <laughs> but then you die That's and a it. bunch of men come in marching. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Just marching. <laughs> Looking like a bunch of stooges. <laughs> <That's right. laughs> 
That's right. Huh? Go ahead, man. Go ahead. March forward and slide back. <laughs> Everybody's doing the curly. That's right. And then they ring a little bell over you. Yeah. Say a few words. They say some words. But you died without God. Yes, Lord. Then they have a cornerstone there. Mm-hmm. The chief cornerstone is God. It's God. That's right. That little big rock on the ground. Amen. David said, who is the rock? Mm -hmm. Saving our God. Saving our God. Mm -hmm. And then it says, the rock that followed them. Mm -hmm. That's Christ. That's Christ. That's Christ. Mm. Do you get what I'm telling you? Go ahead. There is a way. There is a way which seemeth right unto a man. Brothers and sisters, mm -hmm. get out the seem right way. Seem right. Know what you're doing. That's right. Don't be afraid to ask questions. That's right. Don't be afraid to question your preacher. Yeah. After he's done performing that morning, <laughs> when he go to his office, <laughs> Reverend Lucifer, <laughs> Please show us in the Bible. Please show us. <laughs> Where is it? Where is it? Question your teaching. That's right. One of the biggest lies is the belief, I'm going to heaven anyhow. Mm -hmm. You lost your mind. Mm -hmm. Do you know how hard it is to go back with the Lord? Mm -hmm. It is more easier and convenient mm -hmm. to go to hell. Because if I commit one wrong, I'm lost. lost. If you look at the Garden of Eden, there was not a list of things that Adam done when he was pulled out. No. There wasn't a list. One thing. one thing. God plainly told him, touch not the tree of the knowledge, good and evil, the day you eat thereof, you shall die. That's right. He disobeyed that, and what happened? Without. Driven out the garden. Without. In the fifth chapter of the book of Ephesians, it's plainly written that the Lord going to present unto himself the glorious church, not having what? A wow. spot or wrinkle or any such thing but that it should be holy so that means that anybody who goes back with god lifestyle has to be equal to jesus my lord and you know what the book says about him he knew no sin no sin so i don't say wait a minute wait a minute pastor dennis are you trying to tell me <laughs> i have to be perfect the word perfect just simply means complete complete it's impossible to live perfect. That ain't what the book says. Be ye therefore perfect. Do you hear what the Bible says? In Matthew 5 and at verse 48. Jesus said. Be ye therefore perfect. Be ye therefore complete. Even as your Father which is in heaven. Even as God that's in heaven. Is perfect. That simply means one masters the teaching of Jesus mm -hmm. through the act of obedience. That's it. That's all it means. That's right. And what happened is, you have to go against your normal lifestyle. Yeah. Anything that is in our life or of our life that God is against. That's it. One must practice to be, you know, to abstain from your life. That's it. Jesus used it this term. Hate your own life. Hate your own life. You know we don't feel like doing that. And because we don't feel like doing it, God said, yeah, I want you to hate your own life. Your own life. Hating your own life is going against the grain. That's tough. Oh, yes. But because we want to be right, we make an effort. That's right. And we make an attempt to strive gradually, evolving That's around right. the teachings of God. Mm -hmm. Don't think that the knowledge of God you will master in one day. No way. For you have to take your time and let it create you into the man mm -hmm. and into the woman that God wants you to be. Get knowledge, you that are watching. That's Question right. your religion. Evaluate it. Mm -hmm. See where it does it exist. Not in the, con the Library of Congress, <laughs> no. but in the Scriptures. That's right. The oldest mind in the universe is the mind of God. Mm, yes. The most sufficient mind in the universe is the mind of God. That's right. The greatest and the perfect mind 
The only mind that have never been contaminated. That's right. Even when contamination was around. Was around. For Satan was in heaven. Oh, yes. But he didn't contaminate God. That's right. The best mind, the greatest mind, is the mind of God. Now, the mind of God tell you, mm -hmm. you need to be born again. You need to be born again. Because you're not right. That's right. The, the mind of God tells you, mm -hmm. you need to repent of your sins. Amen. Everybody Amen. need to be sorry about their sins. Everybody. Everybody. You can't truly serve God and you, you ain't sorry about your sins. No. I don't mean running across the street to St. Jonathan Mary Catholic Church for boys. <laughs> That's right. Not there. No way. Because no boy will be safe there. <laughs> That's right. I ain't talking about that. No way. Mm -mm. You confess to the priest. The priest should be confessing to you. <laughs> I have been watching you all these years. That's right. Yeah. That's right. Glory to God. <laughs> Repent of your Repent. sins. Mm -hmm. Well, Pastor Jenny, what did I do? I don't remember anything I'd done. Nothing. You that much of a fool that you would even believe that? That's right. Repent, Repent. of your sins. That's it. The word of God says in Acts 2, 38, on the day of Pentecost, mm -hmm. Peter preached the word of God with the Holy Ghost sent down from heaven. Then Peter said unto them, repent. Peter didn't tell you to do what these preachers tell you to do today. No. What did the apostle Peter say? Rep what did the real apostle say? Repent. No, join the church. Repent. Bow your head and raise your old hands and accept Christ where you sit at. Repent. No, the hour of decision. Repent. Prayer, send us prayer. Repent. Cast marbles. Repent. Shoot dice. Repent. Fill beads. Repent. Say a rosary to Mary. Repent. Pray to <laughs> Father Abraham. Repent. Amen. Send an offering. Repent. Sow seed. Repent. That's right. Do you hear? Do you hear? That's it. Any preacher on television that don't tell you to do this, mm -hmm. you can look at any preacher you want any one of them. and put your hand on the television yep. and close your eyes mm -hmm. and repeat after him, right. I'm a sinner. Wash me, cleanse me till I'm white as snow. <laughs> then open your eyes. Then the preacher say, you saved, you're my saved. friend. Mm -hmm. Listen, you close your eyes back and tell him, you're the liar. <laughs> That's, it. That's, it. That's, it, That's the truth. That's the truth. Yeah. Amen. That's right. You ain't no. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> you ain't no more saved then than you are now. Amen. Your, the preacher made a sucker out of you, even did. though you're sincere. Right. But he playing with you. That's right. Any of you watching, any of you here in the midst of these hundreds, if any of you here ever went to any church and the preacher said, if you want to be a Christian today, the church doors is open, I give you a home. And you came in the front where there was a bunch of old drunken elders and That's you right. held all they had and all of you went through this sinner's prayer ritual. Go ahead. You ain't did nothing. Go ahead. You ain't, did nothing. You ain't safe. No. You've been conned. That's right. Even though you were serious. Yeah. You've been conned. That's true. Men and brethren, what shall we do? That's what I want to, listen, what you going to do? Amen. You hear the message of holiness here in Harrisburg right now? Mm -hmm. You that are watching in Canada, what you going to do? Amen. The word of God says what? Then Peter said unto them, repent. This is written. Why don't all these preachers tell you this? Right. It's written. That's right. Whatsoever things are written aforetime time is written for our learning. Amen. That we through patience and comfort of the scriptures might have hope. Hope. What did Jesus say through Peter? Peter said unto them, repent. 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 And what? And be baptized, every one of you. How much of Harrisburg? Every one of you. How much of Harrisburg? Every one of you. How? In the name of Jesus Christ. All right, hold it, because some of you was baptized Father, Son, and Holy Ghost. That's right. You still got baptized wrong. Still wrong. Well, Jesus said do that. He did not. No, he didn't. 
He said, baptize in the name. name of the Father, Son, and Holy Ghost, and the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Ghost mm. is not Father, Son, and Holy Ghost. That's right. Go ahead. Go if ahead. I tell you do something in my name, you ain't going to say Father. I'm a father. Yeah. I'm a son. Mm -hmm. I'm a husband. Right. I'm a boxer. I'm a crippler. I'm a preacher. I'm a fighter. That's right. If you do work for me and I sign the check, I ain't going to put on there, preacher. Preacher. Go to the bank. You ain't getting nothing. <laughs> no, you won't. <laughs> Pastor Jenny, you, 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 uh, they said they wouldn't cash it. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I, I put father on there. Yeah. Well, thank Pastor Jenny. Go on back. No money. No money. Pastor Jenny, something's wrong. <laughs> oh, yeah. They, maybe they don't know I'm married. I'll put husband on there. That's right. Try it now. Try it now. Come on back. No money. Why? There ain't no name on there ain't yet. No name on there. Pastor Jenny, maybe something wrong with the bank. <laughs> well, <laughs> I know I'm a son. I know I'm a husband. Oh, wait a minute. I didn't put son. Let me put son. son. Let me put all three of the titles I got. Yeah. I'll put it in order. Son, then I'll put husband, then I'll put father. Right. You know, and I'll write it big. Big. They can't miss it now. Mm -hmm. Thank Pastor Jenny. Mm -hmm. Oh, the Lord work in mysterious ways. <laughs> Pastor Jenny, the check keep bouncing. Just keep bouncing. That's right. I'll tell you what. Let me just put my name, Gino Jennings. That's it. Get a call. Pastor Jenny, yeah. Hallelujah. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead. Pastor Jennings, I got my money. I got my money. <laughs> Three dollars and fifty cents. <laughs> That's right. Glory to God. That's right. Look closely at the teaching of Jesus in Matthew 28, 19. 19. Go ye therefore. He said, go ye therefore, teaching his disciples and telling them what to do. And teach all nations. That's what's missing. That's it. The teaching is missing. That's it. Teach everybody what? Baptizing them in the name of the Father. That word been overlooked. In mm -hmm. the name of. Mm -hmm. That lets you know one name one is name. in ownership of these titles. That's right. Name of. Just like I own the title Father, Son, and Husband. Right. But my name is Geno Jennings. That's right. Geno Jennings tell you do something in his name. That's right. That's it. I am the owner of, of these titles. That's right. Glory to God. Baptizing them in the name of the Father. Of the Father. And of the Son. And of the Son. And of the Holy Ghost. The name of the Father, Son, and Holy Ghost wasn't mentioned. No, it wasn't. But obviously they knew it. Yes, they did. Because he told them, do it in the name of. of. Now give me Luke 24, 47. Luke chapter 24 and at verse 47. This is after Jesus Christ was taken off the cross and laid in the grave where he stayed there three days and three nights. Mm -hmm. And the everlasting life got back in that body and quickened it and rose on the third day. And he said, all power is given unto me. That's right. And heaven and in earth. And then he gave his apostles his instructions. In Luke 24, 47, he says what? And that repentance. And listen, brothers, when you go out, this is what I want you to preach. And that repentance. I want you to repeat. Preach repentance and remission of sins and removing of sins should be preached How? in his name. How in his name and where we want to start at among all nations beginning at Jerusalem. All right, let's take a step to Jerusalem. And in Acts 2 and at verse 38. Let's go right to Jerusalem. Amen. He said that repentance and remission of sins mm. should be preached in his name. In his name. That's right. Beginning. Among all nations. Beginning where? At Jerusalem. Beginning where? At Jerusalem. Let's go right to Jerusalem. Acts 2 and verse 38. Where the apostles obey Jesus. Then Peter said in unto chapter them. chapter and verse. Acts chapter 2 and verse 38. This is the right way to be baptized. Then Peter said unto them, repent. Repent. And be baptized. How? Every one of you in the name of Jesus Christ. That's the name of. That's right. The Father, Son, and Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Ghost. Amen. That's right. That's right. That's the name of it. That's the name. If you've been baptized and the preacher just said, Father, Son, the Holy Ghost, mm -hmm. you just got wet. Just got wet. He said, do it in the, the name. name of it. That's right. That's right. That's right. Look how much of a hypocrite the preacher is. 
He'll take your money mm -hmm. in the name of Jesus Christ. Yes, he will. With no problem. Mm -hmm. He'll tell you the Lord just spoke to me. <laughs> There's $10,000 in the house in the name of Jesus Christ. That's right. And Jesus Christ said he'll give it back to you 10,000 fold. <laughs> he color them on the side, you're going to buy me a Honda. <laughs> in the name of Jesus Christ. That's right. But when it come down to baptism, baptism. he get dumb. Yeah. I baptize you, Father, Son, and the Holy Ghost. Jesus Holy Ghost. ain't told you to do that. He said, do it in the name of it. Name. So for you to do it in the name of it, you got to know the name you of it. You got to know it. That's right. That's right. Peter said what? Peter said, uh, then Peter said unto them, repent, repent and be baptized every one of you. Every one of you. In the name of Jesus Christ. For what? For the remission of sins. And what's the result? And ye shall receive the gift of the Holy Ghost. Everybody in Harrisburg and every church under the sun. Amen. That have not obeyed the true words of Jesus. True words. When you're baptized in the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Ghost, mm -hmm. the preacher not supposed to say Father, Son, and the Holy Ghost. No. He's supposed to call the name, the name of it. That's right. And the name of it is the name of, Jesus, of Christ. Jesus Christ. That's it. When Saul was on the road to Damascus. Go ahead. Saul was on the road to Damascus, a light shone from heaven mm -hmm. above the brightness of the sun. That's right. And Saul said, who art thou, Lord? Lord. Lord. Mm -hmm. And the Lord said, I am Jesus. I'm Jesus. Oh, yes. Brother David says, know ye the Lord. Mm -hmm. He is God. He is God. Everybody that was baptized, Father, Son, and Holy Ghost, mm -hmm. You got to be baptized over. Over again. Your preacher lied to you. That's right. He didn't understand the scriptures. No. So that take me back to my question at the beginning of the message. Mm -hmm. How is it? He's holding a true book, mm -hmm. but lied come out of his mouth. That's right. You want to know how? Mm -hmm. Because he don't understand right. the very book that he holds. That's right. Don't understand. Same spirit that inspired men mm -hmm. to write this book has to get in a man mm -hmm. to preach. From, the, from book, the book, and have to get in a man to properly explain the book. That's right. That's right. Repent and be baptized, Harris Bird, today. Amen. Amen. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Anybody here want to obey the scriptures and get it right? And want to be baptized in the name of Jesus Christ today. Amen. Stand on your feet, Harrisburg. Amen. Stand on your feet. Stand on your feet. Stand on your feet. Stand on your Wonderful. feet. All of you, all of you that are standing today that did not stand last night, if you're standing today for the first time, you see that brother with his hand up over there? Walk over there to him while I'm speaking. Walk over there to him. Raise your stand up, Brother James. Walk over there to him. Wonderful. May God baptize Wonderful. those that stood up last night and today. And today. May God rack them all up. Amen. We already baptized some earlier today mm -hmm. in the name of Jesus Christ. And while they're getting things together, mm -hmm. everybody who stood up to be baptized, the moment prayer is over, we're going to ask all of you that want to be baptized to go straight in the lobby. Brother White, raise your hand. Move quickly. Bring the bus up. Mm -hmm. Load them up. And let's get ready. James, get ready. Brother Brian, get ready. Amen. You and James, go with them Amen. and baptize them. Go ahead. In the name of Jesus Christ. Go ahead. Get ready. Roll them up. Go ahead. Roll them out. Huh? Amen. Roll them up. Amen. And roll them out. Amen. Everybody, everybody that's want to be baptized, 
you can start moving out right now, right to the lobby. Mm -hmm. All of you that stood up last night, all of you that's here today, go right out to the lobby. Mm -hmm. The church bus will pull up, load on it, get aboard the Truth of God train. Amen. All aboard! Amen. All aboard! Hallelujah. Show them where to go. Amen. Move quick. Everybody who's being baptized, mobilize yourself to the lobby. Go ahead, Get out there by the number. Go ahead. The truth of God train is out train there. Train is out there. That's right. load you up. That's right. Glory to God. That's right. Move quick, brothers. Move quick. Go ahead. We got two brothers to baptize. Mm -hmm. The amount of crowd of people. Amen. Glory to God. God said, you're a catch men. Catch men. I'm so glad that one of the ones that stood up was my cousin. Wonderful. That come to be baptized. Amen. I'm also glad that my youngest daughter went down this morning Amen. in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Hallelujah. I'm also glad Wonderful. that Brother Young, youngest daughter, went down this morning Amen. in the name of the Lord Jesus. Wonderful. <laughs> Amen, brother. All aboard! All aboard. The truth of God trained. Amen. It's rolling. All aboard. It's rolling. Go ahead, brother. Rolling around the world. Go ahead, man. Gather them up by the hundreds. Amen. This is good stuff. Yes, it is. They going down around the world. Amen. Taking advantage of this message. Yeah. While we're alive. That's right. We're just a pilgrim. Yeah. Rolling through the world. Oh, yes. Warning all cre creation, mm. all humanity. Mm. The Lord is coming. That's it. It's time to obey God now. That's it. Everything in the lobby, they on their way to go down in water. Amen. We thank God for them. Amen. I pray that the Holy Ghost fall. That's it. And they come through speaking in tongues. That's right. To my viewers, let us know where you live. If you want to be baptized in the name of Jesus Christ and cannot make it here, we will send men to your area. We have flew brothers to Canada. Yeah. We sent Brother Taj to Canada mm -hmm. a few months ago. People couldn't make it here, mm -hmm. but they wanted to be baptized. They flew down there on a Saturday, I believe it was. Mm -hmm. Took them down in water. Sunday morning, he preached to them. Got back on the plane. Got back to Philadelphia. Later on that evening, yeah. we'll fly you to the other side of the world yes. that do God bidding. That's right. It is no more than our divine commitment That's right. to save those that want to be saved. Amen. I thank God for the ministers Amen. that are here Amen. and the many hundreds of ministers that are not. Pray for our brothers that minister. Yeah. Not just here in America, but in India, Europe, Africa, mm -hmm. the Mauritius Islands, so many areas of the world where brothers, you ministers that are watching, you might as well do what so many other preachers are doing. Oh, yeah. Come on over here. Come on over here. Bring your whole church with you. That's right. And walk with the word of God. That's right. Thank you for listening, brothers and sisters. Now, we're going to get ready to close this great meeting. Before you leave, brothers and sisters, we want you to stick around for a few more seconds for prayer. God has given us a blessed conference. Week after this, we'll be in Jamaica, in the Montego Bay area. For our convention there. Week after that, the 
weekend of the 18th, if I'm correct, of August. We will be in Del Mar, Delaware at the Wicomico Youth Center in the Salisbury, area, Salisbury, Maryland area for our local branch church anniversary. Too many people can't hold it in the church. We'll be at the Civic Center hanging and banging with the word of God. By the time September get here, we'll be back on the plane on our way near Tibet, near Nepal, way in North India. Glory to God. By November, God willing, we'll be on the island of Mauritius. Wish our brothers and sisters there for the convention over there. By December, we'll be in South America, in Chile, and Venezuela. Uh, God bless us, they're coming in out of Chile, Brazil, Venezuela, Argentina, Honduras. Souls is just crying out. We thank God for it. Let us all stand. Let us pray. Eternal, everlasting God, God of the holy prophets and God of the holy apostles, to you we thank and praise for your divine guidance, your infallible understanding, and your perfect wisdom. We thank you for being Lord of creation, being merciful, for guiding us, protecting us, standing by us, and making provisions for us. You alone is God. You have brought us out of darkness. You have introduced this marvelous light of the gospel. We thank you for allowing your word to be fulfilled in the truth of God. That your line has gone out into all the earth and your words, even unto the ends of the world. Look down upon the millions of viewers that watch us over television, that watch us over the internet, and that hear us over the airways of radio. Let this message prick their heart, open up their understanding, enlighten their mind bring them out of all religion that contradicts your divine law eternal God let them feel your hand reach from heaven open up their understanding that they may repent of their sins and go down in water in the name of Jesus Christ as men and women be exposed to this message let the Holy Ghost fall from heaven while they watch it. Let it fall, hallelujah, while they hear it. Work miracles while they hear it. Heal them. Let the lame man walk. Let the dumb talk. Open the ears of the deaf and the eyes, hallelujah, take God of the blind. Look upon the young people who Satan desire to destroy. Give them faith, give them strength, give them hope, give them perseverance, give them stability. Everyone that is here, we thank you for them. Give us all a safe journey back to our separate places. We praise you, O oh God, for the work that has grown by the hundreds and many places by the thousands that come to walk with this message. Break the heart of the stubborn. Melt the heart of the rebellious. That they may understand that you are God and there is none equal unto thee. Look down upon me, O God, your humble servant. Hallelujah! Give us strength in these perilous times. Give us strength. Make us strong more than we are. Make us more stable than we are. Increase our faith. Increase our confidence. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Eternal everlasting God. Increase our wisdom. Increase our knowledge. Increase our understanding. Hallelujah. God, we thank you for all things. Help us to endure. 
everything that devil bring to us. Help us as a people to stand, fight the good fight of faith, and laid hold on eternal life. Look down upon all of our ministers. Stand by them. Strengthen them. Give them courage. Make them brave. Make them firm. Make them solid. Increase their knowledge and increase their understanding. Bless each location around the world and them that don't know you, that they may come into the knowledge of the truth, regardless of their position in life. Let them understand that thou art God and besides thee there is no other. Now God, God and protect us as we go to our separate places. We thank you so much for those that have repented of their sins and have agreed to obey your word and are going to be baptized in the name of Jesus Christ. We ask you to dispatch your Holy Spirit from heaven. Step into the souls of the people. Convert their hearts. We give thee thanks, O Lord God Almighty, which is and was and is to come. These blessings we ask in the holy name of the Lord Jesus. Let every heart say, Amen. Thank you, brothers and sisters.